It's time for another edition of Sire TV, Success in Real Estate, with your host, Robert Burke. Join Robert and his guests, some of the country's leading experts on real estate investing, as they show you how you can purchase properties tens of thousands of dollars below true market value. So whether you are looking for your personal dream house, a fantastic rental property, or you want to buy, fix up, and resell for profit, this is the show for you. Robert will also share his amazing networks of lenders who are are loaning on real estate all across the country. Your financial success is just around the corner. And now, the host of the Success in Real Estate program, Robert Burke. Welcome everybody to another edition of Sire TV. Glad you're here. We have we've had some great shows. We're going to have another great show today. I have some really just fantastic guests. Uh, we think you're going to learn something. Hopefully it'll be some it'll be entertaining for you. One of the big things about this show, and one of the things that we stress here at Sire TV, is that there are really many ways to make money in real estate. There's not just one way. There are ways that work better for different people, and you have to kind of find out what that is for you. Last week's program, we had uh, one of our guests was with a company that provides deals for wholesale deals for people. And you can go to our website, and you can see all of these properties listed that are basically already there for you you know, do your due diligence, but they're, they're, they've already been found for you. But then there are a lot of people out there who really want to get out there and learn this business from A to Z. Um, and that's what we're going to be talking about today. My guest for our first segment is Matthew Elmer. He's with a group called The Real Alliance. Uh, they do teaching and training. You've heard these, these guys throughout the years who do this, but these guys are for real. They really are. They have some of the best training programs for people who want to learn real estate who have never done it before, and really also for people who have done it but want to kind of get better at doing it. So I want to welcome our first guest, Matthew. Thank welcome you, to the show, buddy. Glad Good to, to have you here. Yeah, absolutely. Tell us a little bit about your story, how you got started in real estate, and, and about the Real Alliance. Well, I started on a path that's probably not too dissimilar to many, uh, the path of over-analysis and no action. You know, I spent five years going online, reading everything I could for free, hoping one day I was going to put together how to build a business that could make millions of dollars without spending any money. <laughs> <laughs> uh, needless to say, I, I found a path. I found a, a, you know, there were really four keys that I needed to build my success. And so as I put those four things together, I was actually able to take myself from a place where, because of some tragedy in my life, I actually worked in a sewer. Uh, it was uh, not a real uh, a pleasing job. But I remember thinking uh, what a gentleman told me one day. He said, the only difference between who you are when you graduate from high school and when you die are the people you meet and the books you read. And so I started reading good books. And then little by little, that led me to finding my first real mentor in life. And as I took on you know, education, took on being OK with learning more rather than thinking I knew it all, then I got into a path where I found quality education. And that basically took me to where uh, you know, I, I started to learn how to communicate. Uh, one of the th suggestions I got was if I wanted to build a business, that I'd have to learn how to sell. And I thought, man, sales was a four-letter word in my family. <laughs> <laughs> right. <clears throat> so I took this job in sales and made no money for six months. But I was dedicated to my future. And so finally, uh, actually, I remember my wife writing the le or telling me, she said, honey, we got a baby on the way. And I was like, I'm broke, I'm not making any money, and I don't know what I'm doing. And it was then that I wrote a letter to my son and promised him that I would find a way to provide for him. And that was literally what transformed my whole life. And, and, and the problem was, at that point, I got where I was making money at a job, but I, wasn't making, I didn't have any time freedom. And so then I was looking for a solution. That's where I think a lot of your viewers are probably at. They see that they're maybe making some decent money, but they're not, they don't have the time freedom that they want. I was leaving at 6.20 and getting home at 7.30 at night. So what got you to go from that, the rut to, to, to where you are now? Well, it started out well, I, uh, the search, the hunger for real estate. And I'd bought the late night infomercial stuff and I'd, you know, I'd, I'd, I'd gone to all these different trainings, but I couldn't connect the dots until I really invested in myself. And I went ahead and I invested in myself and, and went to, through a, a very in-depth training. And I got into my first four deals within four months. I remember making the decision, I'm going to buy four properties this year. And I did. I bought four properties that cash flowed $800 a month. And I thought, man, I got it. 
But then I wanted to move from there into actually flipping properties and, and realize that's a different game. And so I started studying that. And within a year, I got that going. And by two, three years from there, uh, because of good mentors and good systems and good uh, education, I was able to take myself to where I now completed, you know, dozens and dozens and dozens of properties and helped people complete hundreds and hundreds of flip transactions, uh, you know, all over the country. Okay, and then what got you from being an investor in real estate to putting together these programs to help other people do this through the Real Alliance? Yeah, you know, I was thinking about that this morning and I remember actually what happened. I was, I was going home from a training and I was, sit I was sitting at a red light and as I was sitting there, there was a car that apparently was not paying attention and hit me from behind. And literally I flipped over the back of the car and I remember laying there wondering, had my life changed forever? And I thought first of my wife and my kids and second of my business. And I thought, what if I don't get up from this? What happens to these people that I'm working with that I'm trying to build a business with? Could they continue on? And I knew that they couldn't. So I figured I had to build a system around my processes. I had to take it step by step by step and create it in a model that they could follow. So I videotaped everything I did. I documented out every checklist, every script, every piece of paperwork, and I put that together in a system first for myself. And then people started asking me about it. They started saying, hey, how do you do this? And I said, well, watch this video. How do you do this? Well, you know, here's a checklist for that. Hey, how do you say, what, do you, what would you say in this situation? Well, here's a script for that. And then realize, man, this is really something that has value. And, and someone once said to me, the only way to make money is to bring value to the world. And I thought, well, what if I started to put this into something where more people could get a hold of? And that's really what was the foundation of what is today the Real Alliance. Well, and, and I want our listeners, our viewers to know that you, that you do these seminars um, different types of seminars. I know you have coming up almost on a weekly basis, um, and then you have a mentoring program, which is really unique. Explain briefly about the mentoring program that you have. Yeah, well, mentoring is, is definitely a key part of it. We call it a platinum mastermind coaching, and it c combines four pillars. The first pillar is the, the pillar that's the most important, which is that you've got the most important, in real, uh, the most important real estate that you can invest in is a real estate in between your ears. Exactly. And so we gotta give you the knowledge of how to do what it is that you're gonna do. And there's not just one way to do it. It's not just buy and holds, it's not just fix and flips. There's short sales, there's owner finance, there's all these different strategies, note buying, all these different things that you need to understand. And so what we do is we give them systems for those processes. Then the second pillar is then you, you gotta speed up the, the, the time it takes to get those deals done. Paperwork can take hours, what if we could turn it to minutes? So there's technology that we put in place. Then third is support. You need experts that can answer the questions when the education has a gap in it. And so we have support and ways in which people can get answers. And then the last pillar, and probably the most powerful and most important, is the concept of community. That you're not on your own. That you become who you hang around. And most likely the people at the water cooler aren't getting you to the success that you want. That's great. The thing I like about the Real Alliance, because you, know, you mentioned this before, but there are, there are a lot of places out there over the years that do these seminars and these guys come into town and, and there's definitely nothing wrong with that I mean it works for some people um, but the fact of the matter is is that they come and they're gone and I love this mentoring and the fact that, that you guys are here and people can come in and they can meet you in person um, not only when when you're when they first meet you but down the road as they need more help they can call you up and they can talk with you it's 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 a unique type of program and it, I think it's a tremendous benefit to people to have that. Yeah, well, that's, well we, we believe honestly that why we call our, our education results-based education. It's because what most of us are used to and why we don't maybe aren't drawn to more education is because it was all grade-based. It was all right or wrong based and that's not entrepreneurship. Yeah. Entrepreneurship isn't about right or wrong. It's about going out there and figuring out the solution that's necessary and sometimes you're going to do it wrong until you do it right. And so what we're more focused on, not how, what your grade is, and not did you answer the question right, but did you make money yeah. using the information? And that's result-based. Well, you know, we're gonna have you on the show many times. I do wanna mention something. You have a book, Against the Grain, um, that you are a co-publisher of, and we have a special deal for our viewers. If you will go to the website, sire.tv.tv, uh, .tv, you'll be able to get this book basically just for shipping and handling, $7. Yeah. Go there and make a comment, send us an email, and we will ship this to you absolutely free 
well, $7 shipping and handling, of course, and you'll get this book from Matthew. We're going to be going into a lot more with you down the road, uh, talking about more of the details of your teaching and your training. This is your first time on the show, kind of an introduction. You've got a great story. I think people want to hear that. Um, but we'll have you back. Matter of fact, I even think next week we're going to have some people who've actually gone through your class. Yeah. And we're going to tell some of their success stories. So again, Matthew, thanks for being on the show. Thanks. Great Appreciate guest, it, man. Good friend. Great. Thanks. We'll be right back, guys. The Sire TV program, brought to you in part by Appraisal Save, your half price nationwide home appraisal service. Sherman Bridge, America's number one rehab lender. Welcome back, everybody. I want to thank Matthew Elmer from The Real Alliance again for being our first guest. Wonderful guy, wonderful company. For those of you out there who are looking to, to learn this business from start to finish, and that's just in your makeup. He has some fantastic training programs, probably the best in the country. Be sure to go to SireTV.tv to check those out. We've got some special deals for you in regards to that. You know, the, part of, the thing I love about this show, though, is that there are many ways to make money in real estate. We have another company that's involved with us, New Western. They're what I call a, a wholesaler. They basically have a knack, a talent, to find great deals on properties. And, but they don't do the, the, the back end part of it because they don't, don't like to do it. So they put these properties up on their website, they put them up on our website, and people can go in there and they have a, it's like going, it's a menu of all these properties that can be bought tens of thousands of dollars below market price. And it's another great way for people who don't have the time, don't have the inclination to go out there and learn this business like you would if you were going to go take a course from the Real Alliance. We have two special guests with us this week who work with a company called New Alliance, one of these rehabbers. We've got Clint Crawford and Jim Rogers. Welcome to the show, guys. Thank you. Thanks for now, having Now, you me. guys um, have been dealing with New Western and buying properties from them for a couple of years. You got started in this a couple of years. Clint, the partnership is, is unique. It's a great way. We talked about that. But how did you guys get started in, in, in real estate and, and your partnership, too? Well, I started off, I uh, got my uh, real estate license and was selling houses. Then uh, Jim, who uh, was actually my Sunday school teacher, called wow. me up <laughs> and uh, asked cool. me uh, yeah. if I wanted to flip houses. So um, I said, why not? So we just got uh, started. We uh, were looking for some houses and then actually New Western brought us the first deal and uh, JC Homes was formed. Well, now you guys had never done any type of real estate before, right? Before. No, no, I had never. I had been in a single family uh, residents, uh, but in the construction industry. In construction. From, yeah, in construction. Right. Building houses ground up. Um, but yeah, I had never done any, uh, any flips. Now, the partnership is, is a cool way to make this work. I, I really firmly believe in this. Um, a lot of people don't want to do this because they don't want to split the money. But, you know, we said there's, there's more money to split, so you both right. come out ahead. But, Clint, you're the guy who, who finds the property. You work with companies like New Western. That's, that's kind of your expertise in finding the properties and selling the properties, right? That's what you do. Yeah, I mean, I, I take uh, everything that they, they put out these properties and then I'll kind of run my numbers and see if I think the ARV is kind of what they think. And, and for the most part, they've been pretty uh, uh, spot on with all the deals we've bought from them. It's important to do your due diligence. Yes, you don't never take somebody's word for anything, and in really anything, I don't believe. But, um, and then with your background, in construction, Jim, you kind of handle that aspect of right. it. Right. Yeah. Clint and I get together. We we cast a vision on what we want to do with the property, and then uh, then I go to work. And then when you get it done, then you handle the, the the back end side of it of selling it, and then you get another property. Right. Now this is something that is amazing. You guys have been have this partnership for two years. You have bought how many properties from New Western? We have bought, you bought twelve properties from New Western, and just a little over thirty. We just bought our thirty first house in two years. Mm -hmm. Yes, sir. That's incredible. Tell us about the experience of 
what is what is the difference, Clint, in dealing with uh, New Western? You know, uh, who have these properties that you can go out and find, and going out there and finding the deals yourself. You're doing both. It, do you find that that that's a great combination to be able to have that, those options? Definitely, yeah. Because I, I sit on in front of the computer for hours a day looking for it, and it's just great to have New Western when they can come to me and say, "All right, here's the deal. Here's the numbers. I can go take you know 30 minutes, look them over, make sure they're right." And it just makes it a lot easier for me. Well, your story is really exciting to me because it's really kind of the heart and soul of this, of our program, and the fact that there is not just one way to do this. Right. There really isn't. You know, we had the Real Alliance for people who want to go and get that training and do that. Got that? You've got people like companies like New Western who have these properties that, like you said, you can just kind of sit there and pick and choose and that type of thing. So it's a great deal. Now, you, the first property that you bought with New Western was a property in Fort Worth, it was on Cumming Street, mm -hmm. right? Yes. We've got some pictures of that, some before and after pictures of that. Clint, walk us through these as you, as you see these pictures. Well, that one obviously was very overgrown. Uh, this house This is the front of the house before. Yeah. Very much uh, not livable. <laughs> okay, all right. Now let's see the next slide. This is, oh my gosh, the same house? Same house. The other picture was the front of this house, and this is the same house after you've Fixed mm -hmm. it up. Okay. Now we've got some pictures inside too. Jim, you're the you're the construction guy here. Tell us what we're looking at here. This is not even uh, uh, anything we don't see on a regular basis, but this is the hall bathroom, and it's just uh, when the house was built, I I'm sure it looked wonderful. But we, we find <laughs> a, we find that uh, we go into a lot of houses, and that's what we that's a, that's how we make money in this is we find bathrooms that look like this, hallways that look like th that what you're about to see, yeah, and then transform into something that's because this innovative. this now is this this is a different. Bathroom yeah, or that's just the master, but it oh, looked very similar. It looked very yeah, similar, looked very same similar. style. Same this style, house was probably tile. built when? Uh, 60s. 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 5, 6, 7. Has that typical look? Yes. Now, this is the master shower mm -hmm. after you guys have redone it. Right. Okay, I think we've got a couple of more pictures. This is. Bedroom. This is a bedroom. Mm -hmm. All right, and I think, I don't know if we had the after of this, but you can see what a disaster this house is. This it is a living room. Yes, this is a living room now. Yeah, and okay. there, there was a lot of sweat and toil in that, uh, that living room floor too. Okay, we gotta go yeah. back to the first of this. Can you guys go back to the first, uh, the front of the house? I, I, I just would love to see that again, right there. This is the after, and we had the before where you couldn't even see it. Now, you guys bought this from New Western. Mm -hmm. Um, now, I'd love for you to kind of share some figures with us, if you don't mind, if you no. don't, but that's why you're here, you know, so hopefully you will. But on that house, you bought that from them. Do you remember uh, approximately what you paid for that house? Yeah, we paid 65000 for that house. And, and Jim, about how much did you have to do to it? How much did you spend on it to fix it up? Um, what did we spend? About uh, 20? Yeah, 20, a little over 20. A little over 20000 dollars on renovations. And what was it worth when you were done? We sold it for 125000 the fifth day on the market. Wow. And this was your very first house you mm -hmm. guys ever did. Right. Success story. Mm -hmm. Okay. And you bought that from New Western. Again, we've got these um, houses on our website. Um, they are you can go to SireTV.tv .tv and we have all these houses that we have with these rehabbers who list these properties and you find deal after deal like that. Right. So now over the course of a couple of years you've bought 13 houses from these guys. So it's or 12 houses from these guys. So it's been a pretty good experience. Yes, it definitely has been. And at the same time it enabled you to kind of get the feel for this business to get a comfort level to be able to go out there and, and find some of the deals yourself. Great combination, right? Yeah, I, I took some of the strategies that New Western applied and then did that for the houses that I was looking to. So that, they've really helped me out more than I can say. So, you know, again, for somebody getting into this, I think it's a great, you know, it's a great opportunity. It wasn't that, you know, it's an opportunity that is, it wasn't afforded back in the day. Um, and it's there now, and, and you have this opportunity, but it, it also is, it's, it's a matter of choice right. in, this, in this business. Well, you know, I, I think that in order, to get the, in order to get started in this industry, a, a company like New Western is critical. It, it really would be very difficult. I mean, we were a little nervous on our first one, but uh, it's taking that first step and, uh, you know, trusting the numbers. We do our due diligence, but uh, so far they've been uh, really uh, upfront with all their numbers as far as what the, 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 the purchase price, the renovations, uh, and of course, there's a little variation in what your finish out's going to be, so the numbers going to vary a little bit. But they've been right on with their ARVs, and I just don't think it'd be, it would have been possible for us to get started without at least this relationship, and then to go from there. Uh, you know, it, it really would be 
it, it would be advantageous to, to have a company like this, like New Western, uh, that's upfront and honest with you. Well, I would think, Clint, you know, you said you spend a lot of time on the computer looking for deals. There'd be kind of a complacency, complacency issue, too. Sometimes you get kind of lazy because you've got this steady stream right. of, of property. These properties do go fast, too, don't they? I mean, oh, yeah. We, uh, actually, the first one, Cummings, we were sitting, we were walking through the house. There were several other investors walking through it. And uh, we decided we wanted it. So they said we needed, a, you know, a check for the down payment. Uh, we were rushing to the bank. I was so scared we weren't going to get that first house, and we got it. And then we got a call uh, back from our New Western guy, and he said we'd gotten it by like three minutes. We'd beat the other guy. Yeah, that's that's a fantastic story. But it, you know, there's a good moral to that too. It's the fact that you know these deals, when you find these type of deals, they just don't hang around. No. You you really have to be prepared to be able to move quickly on them. Jim, so when you get a property, how, how long does it take for you to go out there and look at it and do all your bids and all that kind of stuff? A lot of times, well, if, if it's a really good deal, a lot, of, a lot of what we do is based on what they're telling us. Uh, Clint's going to run, run numbers on the comps, uh, but as far as construction, I mean, we may not even have time to get out there. The better the deal, the faster it goes. Have you gotten to the point where you just, you, you trust these guys so much that you can make decisions because you know they're being honest with you? We have a good feel for them, but yeah. it's not necessarily that we don't actually drive to the house. We're, yeah. one, one of the two of us, we're going to drive and at least take a look at, because a lot of times it's a neighborhood, yeah. you know, that sells houses. Right. So we want to see what the surrounding area looks like, Yeah. Uh, but uh, it's as fast as we can get going. Hey, I appreciate you guys being on the show. You're a great guest. I love the story that you have, the partnership part of it, uh, doing 30 properties in two years. It's fantastic. Great opportunity um, for you guys. And I just appreciate you being on the show. Clint, Thank you. good to be here. Nice to meet you. Nice for Thanks you to be here. Yes. Same, you. Jim. Nice to meet you too. Hey guys, we'll be back in a few minutes. We'll wrap up the show. Don't go anywhere. The Sire TV program, brought to you in part by New Western, America's number one source for investment properties. The Real Alliance, leading individuals to success through real estate investing. Well, welcome back. It's time to wrap up the show, but I've got some important things to talk to you about here before we do leave. I do want to thank our guest, Matthew Elmer from The Real Alliance. Their company, his company, basically, the Real Alliance, has some of the finest training programs in the country. And we have a, a good relationship with them. And if you'll go to our website, SireTV.tv, they have some, uh, some of their programs you can buy, some of their seminars you can attend in person. But regardless, by going through our website, we have some special deals. We've kind of gotten a brother brother-in-law type of deal with those guys and our listeners get discounted rates for any of their materials, any of their classes. So be sure and check that out. I mean, I just recommend these guys. They know what, they, what they're doing. They've done it from start to finish. You got to check them out. Um, and again, I want to thank Matt for being here. I also want to thank Jim and Clint. This is really kind of a perfect example and one of the reasons why we do this show. Um, these guys learned that their partnership, I love the fact that they have this partnership and they realize the benefit of that, but more importantly, they also realize the benefit of partnering with other companies to increase their bottom, their bottom line, to put more money in their pocket. We have wholesale um, companies like New Western that are on our website that list their properties. You can go there. 24-7, SireTV.tv, and you'll see these properties all over the country, and we basically deal with companies that are what I call wholesalers. They, they don't, um, they don't want to do the deals themselves. Their job, their, their expertise, their enjoyment in this business is, is going out and finding these deals, and they have a gift for it, and we have these rehabbers, these wholesalers, all across the country on our website. These guys got started in this business. They didn't do any teaching or training, which is certainly a, a great way to do this. I'm not, there's, you know, again, the approach is that there's not any wrong way to do it, but there's lots of 
good ways to do it. There are many ways to be successful in real estate. And they were able to go, and their very first deal they did, and bought this property from one of these wholesalers and made a profit of over $25,000, had the property on the market for five days. It's amazing. Another thing I do want to talk about is if you, I want to stress this to go to our website. We have some really fantastic things on there. We have all of the people that we're involved with, the people who sponsor our show, um, and these are all people that we believe in. They're all on our website. They're, they're all there. You can check them out. You can find out our hard money lenders, um, our wholesalers, our training programs that are not my training programs, but these other companies like the Real Alliance. You can go to the website and you can see these, uh, these sponsors and these deals that they have. Every one of them are going out there and dealing with people all across the country, but we have special deals with them that we have kind of gotten them to agree to, to be involved with us. One, I totally believe in their programs, I believe in their companies, and I believe in the people who run their companies, but, you know, again, that's, that's, that's great, but we wanted to have special deals for our people, for our listeners. So go to the website, SireTV.tv, and you'll see all these properties listed. You'll have a, a list of all our hard money lenders. We normally talk about hard money lending. We didn't talk about that this show. We will on our next show. Um, but these are the guys who have the money that, that really will finance rehabbers, even people who are new into this business. It's more of an asset-based type of business. They understand your business. Um, and they're out there with millions of dollars to loan on these properties. So there's really no excuses. You can listen to, these show, to our shows and you're going to find that there are no excuses to make money in real estate. Because we, again, we don't talk about just one way to do it like most people do. That's the thing that sets us apart. We're going to have week after week guest experts who are going to be on this show talking about different ways. You've, you've heard two of them on this show about the teaching and training programs, um, about using these wholesalers. Okay, so it's all out there. You just got to check out our website for these great deals. Check with our sponsors. Um, and, and lastly, the last thing I want to say to you guys is also check out our Premier Buyers Club, where we have deals with we have deals with companies all across the country. We have a deal with Lowe's. If you're a member of our Buyers Club, you get anywhere from five to seven percent every time you go and shop there. We have a deal with Sherwin-Williams where you can save anywhere from 20 to 40 percent off of paint and supplies. Those are all things that we have put together for you, our listeners, to benefit uh, from listening to our show, to being involved with us, and just knowing us. The, those are things that um, we work on, or I work on, on a daily basis putting these deals together. You just got to go to the site, check it out, you can send in a comment card. You can also uh, send in a comment for the free book um, for Matt, our, our first guest on the show. Yeah, you just got to check all this stuff out. We're going to be back week after week with more guests, more exciting news, more ways for you to make money in real estate. Until next week, God bless and continued success. Thank you for watching the Sire TV program. For more information regarding the contents of this show, please visit our website at SireTV.tv.